Hey everyone, welcome to West Coast Muscle Saws. What are we looking at some of uh, Quentin's chainsaws? This is my Super Pro 81 here. Not for sale, but Quentin's uh, got a lot of saws for sale. I'm going to take a look at those here in a minute. Just uh, let me get this put away. I'll give you some information here. <laughs> Quentin, he's there in Louisiana, and uh, he's got a bunch of uh, vintage muscle saws he wants to sell. I told him I'd put them on my channel. Everybody likes to look at these vintage muscle saws. And let me rearrange this camera here so we can get a shot of them here. And we'll go through and take a look at them. Can you see that? Let me know here. Okay. That's pretty good. There's an 80, uh, Super Pro 80s, 81s, 850s. And they are all runners, all in good shape. And let's see if we can find this here. Sorry, guys. Not a great picture. That's the uh, when they were brand new. You get one for three hundred thirty-four dollars. Real short bar, and just had fifteen major improvements on it. Just a beautiful chainsaw. That was back, you know, early seventies. We'll move forward to uh, this year, and there are some vintage muscle saws for sale. Really clean Super Pro eighty. Got the wrap panel bars. And the exhaust, decompression valve, real popular on these saws. Not a clean one, it's got the brake on that one there. There's some Pioneers, there's a big muscle saw there. Super Pro. Pro Mac 850, wrap handlebars. 800 that was towards getting there towards the end of the run of the big McCullough's And these are the original handles. You can always tell they got those holes in them there. Those are original uh, starter handles Super Pro 60 and It's got the really rare wrap handlebar on it super rare And there's some more of that beautiful yellow and black beautiful saws isn't that a beauty? That's a beautiful saw there. <clears throat> I don't know if you'd be selling the bars and chains with them. You'll have to talk to Quentin about that. Uh, but that's a beautiful roller nose. But those bars are very expensive. And it's got the... Uh, very rare that this cover was on there. That's very rare. They call that the uh, face, face guard or face mask or whatever. It just... Original ones came out. They didn't have that piece there. Let me see if I can enlarge that and you talk about something that eats your jeans up and uh, cause problems well, That's a rotate that's a rotating meat grinder there. I Know I got my pat leg tied up in one without this guard on it <clears throat> and It'll definitely uh, let you know that um, you're getting chewed up Super uh, 44, and it's got the big handlebars too. Ignitions are right here. The points are right on the outside. That was easy access for the technicians, but uh, also moisture. Moisture got in there, and uh, those saws spent a lot of time in the uh, saw shop getting points put in them. 655, that's a big one. P42 over here. Beautiful saws. Got the little guard down here to protect your hand when the chain flew off, which they did a lot on these. It would uh, supposedly hit that and save your hand. There's his phone number. 
Um, if you got some questions, you got some interest in these, give Quentin a call and he can tell you about that. He's willing to ship these. So get with him, uh, you know, in the States. Uh, he will ship those saws to you. And if you got any questions, give him a shout. Okay, I'm going to get out of here, guys.